Hello, hello! Here we are for another video! How are you guys doing? I hope everyone is well. Because like I always say, if it gets better, it gets better. And it will get better. For me and for you. We are here today for the last video of the 40 GT series. We already saw the second car, the fourth car. Now we are seeing a more recent one. And said, ah, oh, but we already, you already show it to us. I showed a 112 scale. Now we are following the protocol of my collection here. And we are going to show a 118 scale. Mm-hmm. This car is from the company that, uh, I, uh, I always say that this company is funny because every car that they make is a special edition. Yeah, we're talking about that company, Maisto. And the car in question is a 2018 Ford GT. The box, no surprises. You are going to see a lot of special edition okay i've been uh, i've been reading here they are licensed for a bunch of car uh, for a bunch of cars here bunch of brands <laughs> don't know why they chose my east and you are going to see why right now let's go to the car and this is the car Look beautiful, huh? Mm hmm Yeah, it does look beautiful. But I like to restart from the interior of this car and I just hope that I'm going to be able to show to you guys. Yep. Exactly. Nothing. It's just... Uh, what can I say? Like... Uh, a memory of it could be inside the car. We don't have any decals. We have like three is small things under the uh, on the console there three small dots no painting in other color the interior is hard plastic seats does seats don't have uh, seat belts or anything Okay, doors, they don't have details at all, they don't have details at all, it's just, I don't know, it's complicated. One thing that I, I can say about uh, my Easter is that uh, their cars are very affordable. Mm -hmm. Meaning affordable quality. Here, it's not metal. I think that is a composite because it's not plastic either, but uh, it definitely is not metal. But what else can I say, right? So let's start for the, from the motor. You can see, right? Can you see any detail there? We have some uh, grooves, but yeah, 
not many things that we can say oh my god it's beautiful it's well done very detailed but at least we have that right it opens for the, comp the compartment is good the doors open in a way that was a little weird you needed to pull it until here and then let me see if I can yeah it's yeah it's it's weird it's, I'm afraid of breaking this thing I've never seen this kind of way to open anything inside here nothing nothing at all it's just it's just nothing here is plastic with grooves we cannot see through but I'm gonna say something that I can contradict myself right quality is not that great I know that but it's beautiful at least you remember the car right at least you remember the car let me lose here because I want to show the back of the car nothing special at all okay but we have some details everything that you can see is plastic sides it's what you see it doesn't have anything any special the front again uh, let me say something we don't have a grill right it's just plastic with roofs but the headlights kind of have de a lot of details everything plastic everything plastic and under the car oh, I need I need to hold it like this and under the car is another thing that is weird because if you can read there is 2017 for the GT right scale 118 my is to made in China because every company now moved to China then I have the 12 13 five or no, six is the uh, serial number of this car but here in the car it shows uh, 2017 and I'm going to show it to you in the box 2018 so if you ask me so which is the year of the car have no clue okay I do have no clue I'm going to be honest with you did you like the car uh, what can I say maestro maestro they do nice cars let's put something first okay maestro affordable brand meaning cheap cars remember that I told you that you get what you paid for you don't pay a lot you don't get a lot okay this exterior here it's no metal I think that is a composite all the grills 
are not th uh, see-through. They are just plastic with some uh, uh, grooves to simulate the grills. Uh, inside, hard plastic everywhere. The motor, it doesn't have details. It doesn't have details at all. Uh, it has something here and there, just a cover simulating the, the, the Ford engine. Under nothing. The wheels. The rim is plastic and the tire is soft plastic. It's not even rubber, okay? It's not rubber. It's soft plastic. Does it look like a car? The Ford GT? Yes, it does. It does. If you want a car just to put it there and remember that you have a Ford GT in your collection, good. Cheap. Cheap. And it's like $50. I paid less because I bought in a, with discount. I paid like thirty-eight dollars. Do I recommend you to buy this car? Um, don't know. Do you just want to have a, for a new Ford GT 118 scale in your collection? Go for it. I didn't find any other. I didn't find any other. Probably Auto Art has, but uh, when I was looking for this car here, I didn't find any other brand that had a newer Ford GT model available in 118 scale. So. My Isto, it was the only one I bought it, and it was like $38. It was a long time ago, it was a long time ago. So, before 2019, I don't, I don't know the price right now, okay? But, zero quality? Zero quality now, it, it, it was made, right? At least, at least, everything fits, the door is open and it remains open, but the details inexistent. Materials, poor, poor quality, poor quality. I'm going to be straightforward. And I can do that because nobody's paying me anything to say anything else to you guys. So, reviews are honest here. Um, I would pass, but if you just want to have a newer model of 40 GT in your collection and you don't have much money, I buy that one. Buy that one. Is what I can tell you. Okay? And with this car here, we end the Ford GT series videos now, because especially because I don't have any other Ford GT in my collection. <laughs> and I already have uh, a repre uh, representant from every era, okay? I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please, Subscribe to the channel, click the like button. If you didn't like the video, dislike the video, go to the comment and tell me why. If you want to make a comment, please do so, is welcome all the time. And I reply to every, every of the comment that I receive. And I hope to see in the next video that everything going well is going to be next Sunday. Have a wonderful week, and I hope to see you back. Bye.